Who would you say was the most inspirational person you've worked with from the start of your career up to now? Well, probably three people, um, if you don't mind. Not at One all. was a teacher, Wilf King, who died uh, in 2014. I did an obituary for him in The Guardian. And he came down to the Technical College when I was at the RNC, when it was in Shrewsbury. Mm -hmm. And he gave up his time one day a week to help me get what was then O-level physics, now GCSE. And without that, I would, without his commitment, I wouldn't have got that um, science qualification, which helped enormously. The second was a, a, a guy called uh, Ron Ironmonger, who was the leader of Sheffield City Council, who, who didn't patronise me. He, he taught me the, the rough and the smooth. So mm. uh, when I'd got things wrong, he would cut me down like he would have done anyone else. And you think that's Come, what people need Absolutely. To be told. Come, yeah. No... no paternalism, mm -hmm. came round, put his arm around his shoulder and said, look, you can do it, but you've got to learn the, the trade. You've got to be able to put up with the rough as well as the, the smooth. And the third was Tony Blair. And it's unfashionable mm -hmm. now to praise Tony Blair as a great prime minister. I thought he was inspirational and I was very uh, privileged to work with him. Yeah, yeah. That's great, David. Thanks very much for coming in and being part of this. Uh, it's, it's nice to see someone who's gone through RNC, has gone off and had a really successful career and has had the chance to actually come back and, and work again with us. So we're really looking forward very, to your input. Very, very so I'll shake your hand, David. Thank very you very pleased much for to have done in. it. And Thank I you. can is exactly the right slogan. Absolutely. Thank you very Thank much. You very